Feeling like your body's stuck on slow-mo? Even scrolling feels like a challenge? It might be your liver health, giving you a hint. This amazing, but often forgotten organ acts like your body's energy factory. And when it's not feeling its best, you might experience fatigue, bloating, or even skin troubles. But don't worry, today we're talking about delicious, easy to make drinks for your liver. No fancy ingredients or juicers are needed, just simple recipes that pack a powerful punch for your liver health. So let's get started and give your liver some love. Number one, amla juice. Amla, also known as Indian gooseberry, and its juice is made by squeezing the goodness out of these small, green, tangy fruits. It's like nature's own little health potion. Now, on to how it works wonders for your liver. Amla juice is packed with antioxidants, which are like superheroes fighting off the bad guys in your body known as free radicals. These free radicals can cause damage to your liver cells, but antioxidants swoop in to save the day, keeping your liver in tip-top shape. But wait, there's more. A study published in the Journal of Pathophysiology found that amla extract protects the liver from alcohol-induced damage in rats. Yep, you heard that right. Amla is so powerful, it can even shield your liver from the effects of a night out. Now let's talk about how to make this magical elixir. It's super simple. Just take some fresh amla fruits, wash them nicely, and then blend them up with a little bit of water. Strain out the pulp, and voila, you've got yourself a glass of pure amla juice. As for their taste, well, it's unique. Some people describe it as tangy, tart, and a bit bitter. But hey, when you know it's doing wonders for your liver, a little bitterness is totally worth it, right? Number 2. Green Tea Now let's talk about the ever-popular green tea, a classic choice for those looking to boost their liver health. Green tea is loaded with something called catechins. They are known for their powerful effects on metabolism and fat breakdown. When your liver is overloaded with fat or toxins, it can become sluggish and less efficient at doing its job. When you drink green tea, those catechins head straight to your liver. They tell special enzymes in your liver to break down fat molecules into smaller pieces. Once the fat is broken down, it's easier for your body to use it for energy or get rid of it. But here's the really cool part. Green tea doesn't just protect your liver from damage, it can also help repair it. Studies have shown that the compounds in green tea can actually stimulate the regeneration of liver cells, which is super important for maintaining liver health. But remember not to drink too much. One or two cups in a day are good. Also, you can try it hot or cold. Oh, and one more thing, when you're brewing your green tea, skip the plastic tea bags. Opt for loose leaves or paper tea bags instead. That way, you're not only taking care of your liver, but also being kind to the planet. Number 3. Beetroot Juice Beetroot juice is rich in nitrates, which might sound scary, but they're actually pretty awesome. Your body converts these nitrates into nitric oxide, a compound that dilates blood vessels and improves blood flow. And guess what? Better blood flow means your liver gets more oxygen and nutrients, helping it function at its best. But that's not all. Beetroot juice also contains betalanes, which have some serious anti-inflammatory powers. Inflammation is like the enemy of your liver, causing all sorts of trouble if it gets out of hand. But betalanes calm down that inflammation by blocking certain enzymes and molecules that make it worse. Now let's talk about the evidence. There's a study published in the Life Science Journal that looked at the effects of beetroot juice on liver health in rats. The researchers found that rats who drank beetroot juice had lower levels of certain liver enzymes associated with damage and inflammation. In simpler words, beetroot juice might protect your liver from harm and keep it happy and healthy. And hey, if beetroot juice straight up is not your thing, no worries. You can sneak it into smoothies or mix it with other juices to soften the flavor. The important thing is to get those liver-friendly nutrients into your system any way you can. We've made it halfway through our list, and we sincerely hope you've enjoyed it so far. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and ring the notification bell if you want to see more content like this. Let's move forward with the video. Number 4. Turmeric Tea Ever heard of liver fibrosis? It's when your liver gets all scarred up. Think of it like this. When you get a cut on your skin, it heals with a scar, right? But instead of a tiny cut, it's happening inside your liver, and those scars can mess with how your liver works. So why is this bad? Well, when your liver is all scarred up, it can't do its job properly. It's like trying to drive a car with a bunch of potholes in the road. Not smooth at all. But here's where turmeric tea comes in to save the day. 
It works by stopping certain cells in your liver from going into overdrive and making too much scar tissue. So instead of your liver turning into a mess of scars, turmeric tea helps keep it smooth and healthy. Also, a study in the Journal of Phytotherapy Research found that turmeric can actually reverse liver fibrosis in rats. Yep, you heard me right. It's not just preventing the scars from forming, it's actually helping to undo the damage already done. Now let's talk about how to make this golden elixir. It's super easy. Just boil some water and add a teaspoon of ground turmeric. But here's the trick. Add a pinch of black pepper too. Why? Because black pepper contains a compound called piperine, which helps your body absorb all the nutrients from turmeric. You can also make it creamier and tastier by using milk instead of water. Number 5. Lemon Water Lemons are packed with vitamin C. This mighty vitamin helps your liver produce a substance called glutathione, which is basically your body's own detox superhero. Glutathione targets and neutralizes harmful toxins, making them easier for your body to flush out. Lemons also contain compounds called flavonoids, which protect your liver cells from damage caused by things like pollution, processed foods, and even stress. And let's face it, in today's world, our livers could use all the help they can get. But wait, there's another way lemon water helps your liver. It aids in alkalizing your body. Despite their acidic taste, lemons actually have an alkalizing effect on your body once metabolized. This can help balance the pH levels in your body, creating a more alkaline environment that supports overall health, including liver function. There's evidence to back it up. A study published in the Journal of Food and Nutrition Research found that citrus fruits, like lemon consumption, improve liver function in patients with hepatitis C. So next time life hands you lemons, make lemon water and give your liver the love it deserves. Number 6. Watermelon Juice Watermelon juice is like nature's hydrating potion, with its high water content and electrolytes like potassium. When you're well hydrated, your liver can work more efficiently at flushing out toxins and waste, keeping your body in balance. Watermelon juice also contains a compound called citrulline. Now, don't let the fancy name scare you. Citrulline is basically like a superhero for your liver. It helps detoxify ammonia, a harmful compound that can build up in your body and damage your liver. So should you just buy watermelon juice from the store? Well, nothing beats homemade watermelon juice. You know exactly what's going into it. Just fresh, juicy watermelon, and maybe a squeeze of lemon if you're feeling fancy. No added sugars, preservatives, or funky stuff that you can't even pronounce. It's pure, natural goodness straight from the fruit to your glass. While store-bought juices often sneak in extra sugar or artificial flavors that can do more harm than good, especially to your liver. So why risk it when you can make a batch of homemade watermelon juice in no time? And let's not forget the taste. Nothing beats the flavor of freshly blended watermelon. It's like summer in a glass. Store-bought versions just can't compete with that pure, sweet goodness. Number 7. Milk Thistle Tea Milk thistle, also known as Syllabum marianum, is a prickly plant with purple flowers and white veins, hence the name Milk Thistle. It contains a compound called silymarin, with antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties that protect liver cells from damage caused by toxins, alcohol, and other harmful substances. It also supports the regeneration of liver cells, promoting overall liver health and function. Research backs up milk thistle's liver-loving reputation. One study published in the journal Metabolism Open found that milk thistle supplementation improved liver function and reduced liver fibrosis in patients with chronic liver disease. Another study in the journal Cancer showed that milk thistle extract reduces liver toxicity in cancer patients undergoing chemotherapy. Now on to the taste. Milk thistle tea has a slightly bitter taste. Some people find it pleasant, while others may not enjoy it as much. You can add honey or lemon to sweeten it up if you prefer. Just a heads up, if you have allergies to plants in the aster family, such as ragweed or daisies, you might want to stay away from milk thistle or consult a healthcare professional before trying it out. And as always, moderation is key. Don't go overboard with any herbal supplement, including milk thistle. So what are you waiting for? Let's give your liver a nice boost. These drinks are super easy to make and taste good. And the best part? You don't need any fancy stuff, just the simple ingredients you can find easily. Whether you pick the tangy amla juice or the yummy watermelon juice, each sip helps your liver feel better. 
But remember, it's not just about what you drink. It's about how you live. Eating healthy, moving around, and drinking plenty of water are all good ways to keep your liver happy. Oh, and one more thing, don't put too much sugar or sweeteners in your drinks. Too much sugar can undo all the good stuff and cause problems for your liver. So go ahead and take charge of your liver health today. Your body will thank you for it. Cheers to a healthier, happier you. Do you find this video informative or helpful? Let us know in the comments section below. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos. Don't forget to like and share. Stay healthy!